Okay, now let's talk about downwind sailing and watch a few videos. Short version, you wanna have the boat at the right angle to the wind. The spinnaker trimmer really wants to square the kite as much as they can and ease it out, try to float it away from the boat. And then after you float it away, you want to rotate it some more if you can, which is difficult. But if you can get that kite away from the boat and then rotate it to windward so it's away from the main and the jib, it's so much faster. By getting the spinnaker away from the main and the jib, you give it its own breeze. And these high-level crews you can see are doing that here in Cabrillo Beach, California training. The crews are really rotating that pole back to square the pole and put the kite in its own breeze. As the skipper bears away, they square more. If their skipper heads up, they ease the pull forward. And this boat here on the right, 5493, doing a really nice job trying to squeeze down on top of 9050 with a big square of the kite. You can even see the jib come in a little bit, signifying they're sailing very deep. After that, with those things going on, correct angle to wind, proper kite trim, steering with your weight is huge. If you want to bear away, crew hikes, skipper leans in. If you want to head up, skipper leans out, crew leans in. And you're really steering with your weight, just like upwind, you want neutral helm. Downwind, you want the same thing. Let's watch some videos. In this video, you'll see the crew, Kennedy, really rotating the kite to windward and floating it away. So the kite has its own breeze. That's beautiful and it's so fast. And you can do it in about seven or eight knots and up. And here I am in Long Beach, California, sailing downwind with a much smaller crew. So you'll notice I spend more time inside the boat or sliding in towards center line to keep the helm neutral. And I'm happy to move my weight around anywhere necessary to keep the helm neutral. Here are Jack and Marbella again sailing downwind. And you can see Marbella working really hard, rotating that kite, floating it away, and moving her weight in and out, you know, hiking to bear away, leaning in to head up. Uh, Jack's not moving a ton. He's focused on driving and pumping the main from time to time with Marbella. And the boat is balanced and he's not using much rudder, and that's key. Coordinated, working together.